guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you how to make these cute little pineapples. I made three of them. So, what you're gonna need are three rubber, well, y light yellow and dark yellow rubber bands, and you don't have to do the different color greens, but if you want, you can do two colors of greens. Let me get that right now. Okay, got my rubber bands. Oh yeah, and you can make different types of yellow colors, and that's what I'm doing. So, let's get started. This is a no-loom tutorial, and we're only doing a, using a hook. So, let's get on with the tutorial. So, first you'll take a yellow rubber band and make a cap band. As in, you... You... You make a cross with the rubber band like this. You loop it two times, and then loop it a third time so that you have like these three minute loops on your hook. And then right after that, get two yellow rubber bands or any other color you're using for the pineapple and take the cap band off the hook just like that. And then put those extra rubber bands right on top. Your charm should look like this. And do that one more time or two more times. So take two yellow rubber bands. And take these two stitches right off. Sorry, not stitches, rubber bands. And now do that once more. Grab two yellow rubber bands and loop it over. Now your charm should look like this. This looks nothing like a pineapple. <laughs> so now you are going to take the cap band and put it on your hook. This is going to be a little hard, but I know you can do it. And then take two more yellow rubber bands. And then take the cap band off the hook. And then, as you can see, the cap band is right now on the side. We don't want that. We want it to be on the middle. So we have to um, chain one once again. Take two yellow rubber bands. And then take these four rubber bands right off the hook and put those stitches back on. Now the yellow rubber band is right in the center again. This will be a little harder than the cap band collecting for the first step because you have to take the cap band once more and do that again. Take two yellow rubber bands and then take the cap band off the hook. And then do that again. Take two rubber bands. And take that four first rubber bands right off the hook. And there you go. You made your yellow part. Now with the, the yellow rubber bands right on your hook, Slide them down, just like that. Doesn't have to be too deep. Now we're heading on to the top part of the pineapple, like the leaves. So for the leaves, you're gonna have to do a cap band again. Loop it three times right on your hook. Okay, so now you should have three loops on your hook. Now take two rubber bands and take the cap band off. And now do that two more times. As in, take a rubber band, make a cap band, and then take two rubber bands, well, green ones, and then take the cap band off and do that again. We're really close to being done, you guys. 
and do that once more. Take a rubber band, make it into a cap band. Make sure the cap band is not too tight so that the cap band can slide off the hook easier. Or easily. Sorry for the bad grammar. It may be a little tight with all the rubber bands right on the hook for the last stitch, but you can do it. And now when you have everything right on your hook, it should look like this. Now we have to connect the base and the leaves together. To do that, take a green rubber band and take the leaves off first. And now when you take all the leaves out, take off the base. As in, take all the rubber bands off your hook. That's what we're doing here. It may be a little messy because of all the rubber bands you're taking off, but it's going to be easier when you get the leaves off. And now put the ru ru rubber band you made connect on your hook, and now it looks like this. Now you have to make a slip knot. Tighten the rubber band, and with this extra loop, if you don't want it to be a charm, just put it on top. And there you go, your little pineapple. Hope you like this video. Subscribe to my channel and leave a comment down below. Bye!